Welcome to another episode of Trundlebed Tales. Now, today's episode is going to be a little different. It's part of a series I'm calling Trundlebed Trails, and it was inspired by these commercials I've been seeing lately where they have kind of this generic nature scene, and you're supposed to look at it and calm down. And it occurred to me that maybe Laura Ingalls Wilder fans would like to have some things like that that were specifically related to Laura. And so this is the first in that new series, though you can look at them in any order. And this one's going to be a little different. What I did for this one is I fixed my camera on uh, my mount, so it's right on my dashboard, and I hit go and I just was letting it record. And I actually was thinking that I would uh, just be able to have part of it or that maybe I would let it on till we wabasha. But I decided to, uh, I didn't leave it on that long. So what I ended up doing is this is uh, south of Kellogg. It's going along the Mississippi River and I think it's already widened here, so it's technically Lake Pepin already. But I just thought that people who don't live in this area or who haven't been to this driftless geographic area would enjoy seeing this footage. So I decided to put the whole thing on as a, a Trenderbud trail, even though most of these are going to be just a fixed camera sitting there for a couple minutes. This actually takes you a good distance along the river and I hope that you enjoy it. This area is known as the Driftless Area and it covers southwestern Wisconsin, southeast Minnesota, and northeast Iowa. And it's this kind of landscape that's got lots of hills and if you go along you'll notice that all the hills are roughly the same height and that is because uh, this area really isn't hills it is valleys because uh, what was the top level of the hills you see was deposited uh, on in layers and that was the top of the land then the rivers and things going through uh, took down bit by bit and wore down eventually these valleys into that area that was flat. And uh, this was actually the landscape of a much larger area, but when the last glacier came through, uh, it really kind of scooped it out. Uh, and so most of Iowa and this area of, of um, Minnesota will be rolling kind of prairie, but that's where the glaciers were. And this is the area where they missed. Now, I'm not going to talk the whole time. I'm sure you're disappointed. In fact, I'm going to let you go and watch this right now. But just as a, a heads up, what you're going to hear during it is my pump organ rendition of the Trundle Bed Tales theme song because uh, if I had shut off everything in the car, you'd just be hearing the car. And I actually was listening to the radio while I filmed this because it was just going while I was driving. So I hope you enjoy it and that you will stop by again for another episode of Trundle Bed Trails. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.
to the end of what I shot of driving along the Mississippi River and I hope you've enjoyed the trip. I want to just take a minute now and remind you if you enjoyed this to be sure to subscribe to the video channel and find us all around the web. There are podcasts on Blog Talk Radio, a Facebook page, Twitter, and of course Instagram and my blog. So look for us anywhere you want under Trundle Bed Tales and I hope that you uh, will share out the news because I want everybody to see this brand new series. And remember, brighten the corner where you are.